friends today in this tutorial we will learn how to create a free website on weebly.com okay so this is a simple three step registration form you can fill this up so i am doing that let's put the email address now and now put the password now click on get started okay all right so now weebly is asking us what do we want do we want to create a website or a blog or we want to set up an online store so let's click on the first option we want to create a website now we will choose a theme we can choose the first theme as we can change the theme later also so let's pick the first theme now this is a window where it is asking us to set up the domain and other informations so let's let's close this out as we can fill this later okay so let's close this window all right now here you can put the name of the site and these are the pages and this is the theme that we are going to work today now these are the widgets or the plugins that you can choose this is the text heading title heading widget you can drag and drop it on the theme and this is the text paragraph widget so you can you we can use this plugins okay but first let try and make it more professional okay so let's go to settings and uh, let's put a site title okay so this is the title of our site now beneath it says show title on the top of your pages so let's uncheck this box okay all right and let's click on save So this is the site title and now click on SEO okay now under SEO you have to put in the site description and then meta keywords and then this footer code is basically used for Google Analytics tracking code okay and uh, there's a header code it is used to put in the Google Webmaster Tools verification meta tag okay and uh, weebly also provide 301 redirects facility okay so let's click on save okay and uh, all right so now move back to our main website okay now let's click on pages okay and select no header okay right now these are the three pages at the moment we have home about contact now if you want to click and add, click if you want to add another page you can click on this add button now they are providing options like you can either create a standard page or a blog page or a store page if you want to create an online store or an external link okay so let's click on the first option standard page okay and it is saying that if you want to create a sub page under this menu you can do that by simply dragging the page underneath that first page okay so if i uh, drag this page under under contact then it will become a sub menu of the contact menu okay so now let's put it back and let's go to the okay now let's name this page as services okay so now we have four pages in our website now let's remove the header from all all of the pages that will make the website look more professional okay all right now click on save and edit all right 
so now our website is loading all right so now we have four pages and it is looking blank okay so now we can start to fill the details first let drag the title widget and put the title of the website so i'm putting in the title of the website it is mp online tutorials okay and now we are going to put a paragraph okay and with a picture okay so you can drag and drop the picture from your computer let's put the tight uh, let's put the all right so now we have put the paragraph widget and the image widget widget okay now let's put the image let's drag the image to our paragraph okay all right so now we have the image has been uploaded okay all right I have already created a paragraph so let's paste the paragraph in the text widget okay and now you can edit the image also you can either put a link to your image or you can set the spacing of the image okay all right so let's put the bottom margin to small and okay all right then caption if you want you can change the caption you can edit the caption or put a caption on the image now put a alt tag to the image so i'm putting an alt text to the image okay all right So now it looks more professional if you want to create another paragraph then you can drag a spacer that will create some space between the two paragraphs okay if you want and then other options are like images and gallery so suppose if you want to uh, put some photographs of your online store or of of your company so you can do that by go to about page and put a gallery slide show of your shop or business okay so and then in the contact page you can add the google map so that the visitors of your website will be able to know the address of your local business by the help of the google map okay so this is a very helpful widget let's move back to home page right and let's fill uh, let's put a contact form for the visitors so that the visitors can provide a feedback for our site okay right and this is html code widget that you can put uh, if you want to put any html code on your website then you can do that by dragging the html widget okay let's edit the contact form first you can type in please write to us or you can type in please leave a reply that would be more appropriate okay so that please leave a comment so that the visitors can leave a comment and they can provide a feedback uh, that now if we can uh, put this uh, comment box in the center of the page that will look more attractive in order to do that we can add a spacer and now let's make this space to none okay now put the shift button and drag it on the right hand side so now we have okay 
right so now the comment box seems to be in the center of the page looking more attractive now okay right and if you want to add another paragraph you can add the spacer in between yeah and if you do not okay so let's uh, we can add the button and uh, okay and you can add the button also you can add a link to your button that will help the people to get into the other page you can type in read more and you can add a link to the other page also okay so now it looks more professional search tool search tool widgets is basically for the paid users you have to pay for it and uh, hd videos and audio you can add hd videos and audio to your website but you have to uh, purchase the account first okay this is a free account so we cannot use these features uh, then uh, there are options for to add google adsense if you want to add any quotations or quote mark you can add the quote marks and then these are social icon buttons and then some other buttons okay so let's try the social icon widgets and try and put it on the top left and uh, top right hand side of your website okay mm, that will look more appropriate there now you can add if you have you know your facebook fan page you can add a link to that from here so these are basically social networking icons for your website all right friends so you can add like facebook twitter linkedin and if you have a personal e uh, if you want to let the people to contact you by email you can add your email address also now now there are three options we have either we can use a subdomain of weebly or in, we can purchase a domain or we can connect a pre-purchased or pre-owned domain with our weebly site and we can opt for any of the hosting plans from weebly but now since we are creating a free website let's choose a subdomain of weebly so i'm putting the website address mp online tutorials dot weebly dot com and let's click on publish button you can choose a category so let's choose personal and let's click connect okay so now our site is publishing now let's fill this small captcha now click on ok publish my site and let's see our site is getting published now so it is published let's click on the link and open our website so now this is our new website and see it looks more professional and attractive okay and these are various pages okay friends um, although we cannot add videos hd videos and uh, audio but we can certainly use youtube videos okay so i'm gonna show you how to add a youtube video to our weebly website let's drag the youtube widget to the about page okay and now we need a youtube url id so let's move back to our youtube channel this is our youtube video okay now click on share and get the html code or you url id and now paste the url id on this box you can position your video left I think middle is fine so let's keep it now 
इट इज़ अवर वीडियो एंड इट इज़ इम्बेडेड टू अवर साइट ओके नाउ लेट्स क्लिक ऑन पब्लिश ओके सो अवर साइट इज पब्लिश नाउ राइट सो नाउ फ्रेंड्स यू कैन सी दैट द यूट्यूब वीडियो इज इम्बेडेड ऑन अवर अबाउट पेजेस एंड विजिटर्स नाउ कैन वॉच द वीडियो ऑल्सो सो इट्स बिकम मोर इन्फॉर्मेटिव नाउ सो नाउ फ्रेंड्स यू कैन सी दैट द साइट इज लुकिंग वेरी प्रोफेशनल 